Hi, welcome back. Let's uh, try to quickly finish remaining configuration and uh, creation of the sales order. So, bit tired. So, I think we have created all these characteristics and characteristics values, and we have assigned class, class creation, and class assignment. It's time for configuration profile. Let's go to the SAP. Let me log in. What is the transaction for creating configuration profile? The transaction code is CU41. Okay, you have different options available to choose. In this task list, standard network, and a model service build specifications, just choose material. By default, it is chosen material. Let's click here and let's go back to uh, let's go back to the notepad now. One second. That's why I have noted down this material. Let's copy this and go back. Give the material and press enter. Now we have to give your class type. Class type is what? 300. What is your? This is your class name you have to give. Okay. So let's press enter. Let's say this, okay. Uh, So now you can able to see this. All these are the uh, assignments you have. Now, now what you have to do is, so let's uh, double click here. If you can able to see here, go to the, this config initial screen. You have to select the sales order. Okay, and application. Let me show you this one. You have to choose this is for sales and distribution where you're supposed to do it okay and you can able to choose uh, if any bomb explosion if you required you can able to do it a single level or multi-level and okay sales order if you want you can able to do manual changes allowed So once we have done all these things, even you need not require to do manual changes and all those things, don't allow. Okay, let's keep this. Let's keep it in single level. Let's save this, okay? Once you have changed the configuration profile, now let's try to create a sales order, okay? With the same material. So let's go for standard. So this one, 56. Let's give some quantity and press center. Okay, now you can able to see how exactly, whatever the hard work you have done till now for your configuration, it came now. Okay, so iPhone model choices, let's click here. So I'm choosing iPhone 15. 
Okay. So, so this is, I'm just choosing 256 GB. This is how we, you customer can able to order. See, now see, I have given a simple example, certain times in characteristic values in real time, like, you know, some 50 or 100. For example, a certain measurements they want for certain sheet or else glass, types of glasses. I have seen all these things. Okay. So let's uh, choose the red. Okay. And choose the phone. Let's choose 6 GB variant accessories. So now you can see multiple values. If you say that single value means it's option button came. So in that I'm giving charging cable and charging pin also. That's why this is the advantage with this. Let's press center. See now it became green. Okay. So then So now it is picking all the materials now. Okay. So let's keep here, no issues. So now this, for this material, PR00 is missing. And if you look at here, so your variant condition is missing. Okay. Let's save this. Probably like a cost accounting also not active that is required. And Let's try to save this order as of now. And we'll try to fix. We'll try to fix remaining issues in next session. And we will try to activate cost accounting and after that. And we'll try to check. Next important thing is. Okay. What is dependency let's create some dependencies and for this example and let's try to do something better to create OTC cycle with configurable material till then thank you i wish you all the best have a great day let's close this the session